Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and I'll be doing a news and update and first up we'll be doing a hunting video. So what you're seeing right now, 68 Camaro, the tuned uh, version, part of the Hot Wheels art car set. This will be a fantastic custom candidate. So I think I'll be getting that one. I could do like a rat version of that, that, that would be awesome. Then the recent Matchbox Wagon 5 pack as you're seeing right now cars are awesome and you can actually see the names of the cars at the right side so take a look at the names right there the Oldsmobile down below looks fantastic love this Chevy right here I think this is like the best one in this five pack if you agree with me on that leave a like and this is the Cadillac uh, CDS right yeah, CDS looks awesome uh, Ford Fairlane uh, I think that's the second best looking in the set yeah, and another one right here, a Matchbox EV and Hybrid set. Uh, I think this is not new because the new one has the Honda E, I, I believe. Then Matchbox CD driver set. Look at how beautiful uh, the cars are in this set. There's a Honda Civic hatchback. Yeah, love that uh, pickup right here. There, Chevy Silverado. Uh, it looks short in my opinion but yeah look at the julia right here that's fantastic man that's a fantastic julia i think that's the best one in that five pack so yeah a lot of wagon set right here yeah and some are uh the older five packs oops <laughs> yeah older five packs so uh not in a rush to get the wagon set I'll probably wait for a sale because the five packs don't sell uh, high here but yeah look at this car in here that's awesome awesome looking Aston Martin <laughs> and look at this uh, tra uh, trailer yeah reminds me of Jollibee man, <laughs> because of the colors yeah McDonald's and Jollibee it has the similar colors of, of those brand they still got the uh, Volkswagen Beetle as you've seen right there yeah multiples of the Volkswagen Beetle so yeah uh, on the Hot Wheels section here's some sets with the tracks and the cars awesome here's a Jeep Gladiator and oh this is cool this is cool glow in the dark duck and roll that's nice. Mazda RX-3, Mad Mike. Is this a super treasure hunt? Okay, just the regular version. So I thought I could get lucky this time. But yeah, moving on to the other store. Ooh, okay. Big fan of this. Won't mind multiples of that. So yeah, I'll, ooh, I'll be getting that. Yeah beautiful beautiful uh cool combi here's the bat uh bat plane bat part i kind of forgot what the name of that one is cool looking mazda right here yeah i, I think this one had the super treasure version if i'm not mistaken ford bronco nice yeah i'll be i'll definitely be getting that that one i think i have something in mind again custom candidate also for this Pro uh, yeah i'll be getting to one for the carded collection and one for a uh, possible uh, custom ford bronco coming soon ford mustang gt again roger Dod jo dodger right there as you see another rx7 and so so far these three right here i'll be uh, going Moving on to the other side, another Roger Dodger. Yeah, this is fun. This is really fun hunt here. So yeah, I'll be going on to the other side. And uh, let's see we, if we can find some more beautiful cars. Yeah, what do what can we find here? Oops, nothing so far. Ooh, big fanboy here. The recolor Subaru Impreza, man. 
Yeah, I got the blue one. I think that was a blue one or silver. I forgot. But, ooh, the black one. Nice. That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> what else? What else is in here? Yeah, I, I can't find some more cars. So I think that will be all for our peg hunting video. And we will be proceeding right now with our news. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed our uh, quick peg hunting video. And let us proceed uh, to today's news. So up, I'll be updating you on uh, the latest cars from Hot Wheels, Majorette. We also got some cars from Greenlight. And I hope you will continue watching and you will enjoy this one. So let's start today's news with this awesome McLaren Senna. This is from Majorette. Thanks to future diecast bros for this. So first up, before we we will uh, take a look at the bad stuff for this car, let's check out first how awesome this one is. As you see, it has opening doors, and yeah, it is beautiful by the way. And what is really unique with the McLaren Senna's is that it has like windows on the door. I don't exactly know what the exact term of this one is but if you know leave a comment down below that's really cool and i think that's the only car all right now that has windows on the door again correct me if i'm wrong and let us yeah check out some of the bad stuff in here as you can see the gaps man look at the gaps yeah on the door between the door and the body is just really big so that's one a uh, negative part of bad part with cars that have opening parts especially for 164 scale cars as you see right here that is a really big gap <laughs> so i don't know why this is so big and look at the fender right here there's some i don't know man there's some yeah it's not smooth it should be like a perfect like, curve in here but look at the uh, bad like casting right here as what we are seeing right now so that is quite sad because this car is really promising yeah as you see right here huge gap between that but look at the opening doors that is so cool once again the windows i wish they made this one like clear instead of this just like dark black but anyways still a fantastic car despite the issues but for the major at Senna I I'm not quite sure if this is plastic or they just painted this one black but I have seen like on YouTube this one the Senna indeed has like windows uh, on the door so yeah despite the issues it is still a fantastic casting uh, the wheels look okay for this one yeah pretty cool right there the front end looks awesome just the gaps man and yeah, the fender has some issues and all then moving on check out the upcoming uh, id series car for 2022 a chevy bel air from hot wheels looks awesome it looks really clean right here again it has like the standard id series car wheels but the body it's just fantastic i love the chrome interior also and i just love the font uh, on the like the logo of the bel air it is just sexy looking that's what i always notice in the bel airs the the font right here at the logo but yeah this is a sexy car and look at how how beautiful this one is amazing details up front uh, yeah, tail, tail lights detail, the rear is detailed right here as you seeing right now. Once again, yeah, it looks like a super treasure hunt without the rubber tires. And yeah, look at that. And of course, doesn't have metal base. And then from green light, uh, take a look at their upcoming blue color uh, series right here. And uh, it features, I think, uh, five cars all in all. So let's uh, check out each one of them. So first up, a 68 Ford F250 right here. 
a classic F250 looks awesome right there got Texaco livery then a 74 Jeep right here looks awesome as you're seeing right now I'm a big fan of like old again boxy cars that is my thing 76 Dodge B100 damn this is nice I don't think we have a lot of Dodge B100 164 scale cars out there but yeah this one looks awesome 83 Chevy C20 Scottsdale looks fantastic and then of course this really clean looking 1990 Chevy S10 look at that got the Pittsburgh uh, Steelers colorway right there in black and yeah gold that looks awesome 2017 Ford F-150 looks fantastic Man, green lights are just making tons of beautiful cars so I think uh, it's more than five cars sorry for my mistake yeah definitely more than five cars and moving on here's another look at the recent Honda N600 from Hot Wheels thanks to Mass Selective Store for this one so again I'm a huge fan of this car uh, still haven't seen this one in person yeah we are kind of late in, in terms of like cases here but I'm really excited to get the first N600 probably get multiples of that and yeah as you have uh, watch in my other videos I am yeah, getting the itch to do custom so this will be a custom uh, fantastic uh, candidate for custom I believe yeah I'm still learning I'm still getting uh, tools proper tools but yeah my hands <laughs> uh, starting to get the itch for customizing diecast car so let's see whether or not if I can continue on with my dreams of just uh, doing some custom cars yeah that's awesome man that is awesome so that is all for our uh, news and update for today and also fun uh, peg hunting video I hope you enjoyed this one if you did please smash the like button also subscribe to the channel more than half aren't subscribed yet so please do subscribe and I'll be seeing you on our next episode have a great day guys thank you for watching